Hey guys, welcome to an Assassin's Creed video on how to get the Raven armor, the Hidden Ones armor set, the one we're looking at right now. So obviously this is designed for your assassin well, stealth kind of build in the game Assassin's Creed Valhalla. So this armor set comes with two bonuses, which is an increase to assassination damage when crouched and undetected for 10 seconds, as well as an additional increase to headshot damage. So the first one is located right over here. So if we zoom in, you can see our settlement is over there. We're going to go right above it to Ledchester City. And this location right over there that I just clicked is where the first piece is located. Once you get here, you'll see a circle of pillars, but you're not going to be going there. You're going to be going to this big section over here where you can shoot down this. And there is a entrance that will open up on the ground here that you can go into this cave and go explore. So most of these pieces are really, really hidden in, like in these caves and stuff, so it can get a little bit confusing. You're going to go slide through that first slot in the wall there, slide through the second slot of this wall over here. This piece is probably the easiest to find, and it is located right over here. So that's your first piece of Hidden One's armor. The second piece is located in the south in the city of London. So if we zoom into London over here, this is the piece right over here that we're going to be collecting. And once you get over here, you'll see there are these kind of weird circle like tree things here. And we're going to climb this giant big ass kind of like wall thing. And what we're going to do is we're going to be diving in between that like kind of cage, kind of wooden cage thing, which you can see is right over here. So you're going to jump here and you're going to dive straight through into the center of this kind of like room, if you could call it. And then from here, don't worry about the actual room. You can't do anything here just yet. So go down, swim directly downwards and into this kind of area over here. You'll see there's two different kind of entrances. One is with a kind of grassy patch thing here. We can get a normal chest. And the other one is on the opposite side of this with a kind of wooden thing blocking it, which you can just attack to destroy so that you can swim in here and continue along the path. I'm going to just show you where we're swimming to. So you're going to swim up here until we get into like normal ground so you can just navigate yourselves and see what I'm seeing. Once you're in this area over here, there is a chest at the end around this corner over here. You can just dive in and collect the chest that's located right between these rocks over here. There's nothing behind it, so all you have to do is just loot this chest and go back up. So now we're going to go back onto these things here once you notice that you're up here you'll see there is a destructible wall that we can destroy and inside this wall and in this room you'll notice is the next piece the next piece of armor that we're gonna collect which is located right <laughs> I don't know why the character always goes <laughs> I never understand that like she runs into the table she's like Wah! <laughs> what? And that is your next piece of Hidden One's armor. Let's look at the next location. So the next location is located here, roughly about in this area over here. And we're going there, but we're actually going to go over here, which is where the entrance is. And once we get here, you'll notice there is a kind of breakable floor thing, which you have to break either using explosives or like, you know, explosive arrow. Go inside here. This one is a little bit tricky, if I recall. And then we're going to go through here and just keep going this way. So you go in, you go down, you go right. And then you just keep following the path. Obviously, it, it does lead kind of straight in a way. Here, you're going to go straight up this thing right at the beginning because you're going to just confuse yourself if you try to explore this place. Honestly, I spent a lot of time here trying to figure out what the hell's happening. And then you're going to go past this kind of area over here where you've already moved these rocks out of the way so that they're open, kind of like open the way for the door. And then you're going to head this direction and we're going to take a right over here. Now, this is where it gets really confusing because there's this water section here. What we're going to do is we're going to swim in the water and we're going to go to the right and you'll see there is a section that goes up like this uh, in, under the water at the right side of that room or like from the direction that we swam in and you come up here you see there is a locked door there's a locked door on the other side as well I believe um, what we're going to do here is go to the left up this little area here and you can see we can climb up into this section now this section is going to take us to where we need to go so from here you'll see there's the locked door at the bottom on the right there that we can't get into we're going to jump across here we're going to go straight across this section here you'll see there is more water to swim in Fantastic. I hate this water, man. You can never see anything like the screen is so dark. Constantly have to use your sight just so that you can see underground and, and through all the stuff here. So just collect all this uh, stuff here. Um, we're needing the key specifically. And then we're going to go up back to where we like swam into this area. And you'll notice there is a door in the section as well. This key that we just collected opens this door right over here. And once we go in here, you can see there is a chest available for you right in front here. But what we really need is to shoot the lock of that door over there so that we can get it. So just chuck your torch if you are using a torch. Shoot that lock there. You can't get this one here. I tried. Uh, it's actually not located there. So collect that chest and then move on back to that kind of main door that's blocked there. Obviously, you see you can't shoot it, so you're going to have to go to that first section where you jumped across. 
Um, it's like you park it right across there. Go up here. Go back down to that first door that was locked that you weren't able to open. And you'll see now it is able to open. And you can come in here. You can break the other lock and just because it was annoying. And your piece of armor is located right over here. This is probably the most difficult one <laughs> to find. Really, I struggled with this one quite a bit because I got lost a lot of times with this damn water. All right, so the next piece is located in Gloucester Shrier, which is to the left of your map. You can see it's located right over here by this kind of like area here. And we just have to go to this place over here, about there. And you can see once we get here, there's these giant statues and there is a door in this kind of like shrine looking as place. And we're gonna run through and go straight into this door. And once we're in here, you'll notice that it goes down into a staircase and we're gonna go and break this so that we can slide through here. And then in this room, I believe um, we need to keep heading on along the path that it goes. And you'll see there is a breakable wall that is hidden over there, which I believe either has treasure or something. I can't recall. One of them has treasure. There's two breakable walls that you will find. But first, go down to this area over here. And you just climb down. Obviously, just shoot it and climb down. You'll see there is poison around, so make sure you, you don't stand in the green poison too much because your health will go down as long as you're standing in the poison. And then... You will see there is explosives on the like top section, so you can go back to the top section, grab an explosive, and just chuck it at one of the walls to to open it up. There is a treasure chest that you can open with one, and the other one is the one for the for the main kind of objective that we're looking for. So just find the the break broken breakable wall, I guess the breaking wall. So there we go. We broke the wall, and then inside here you'll see it opens up the room to the next armor piece to collect. And all you have to do is obviously just loot the chest, and you are done. Fantastic. That is four pieces of the hidden one's armor. Let's go grab the next one. So the final piece is located in the north in North Umbra by Jorvik City, and it is located right at the south kind of west area. It's located over there, but the entrance is over here. So we're going to just teleport here and we're going to go to the entrance. You'll see it is a wooden kind of hatch above the thing. And again, we're going into the ground for more swimming. Man, I'm getting really tired of these dark swimming caves. It's just, it's just annoying. So you're going to swim along this path. You really can't get lost. Just keep going. Just keep going straight as, you know, as long as it's kind of straightforward until you get to this section over here. And you can go through here. Now, this leads into a giant big chamber, which can get also quite difficult. But we're going to go to the right, that section over there that I just looked at. And we're going to climb over here. And you can see there is these movable objects that we can grab here. You can just grab the first one and pull it backwards so that we're able to go around it and into another slide through the wall. And we can jump across over here and head into this big chamber room over here. And as this follows, you'll see this takes us to a kind of entry point for our almost final thing. This gate's not locked, which is fantastic. In here, there's a chest, but it is locked. There is a key, but it's caged in the left there. You will see in this area that we can now see the chest that we need to get to, and it's over there. But the key is located right over here, so don't get too like worried thinking it's in that big main chamber. It's actually just like right in front of you. You just literally just collect it, and you can use this on the gate right over here to get the armor set piece, or yeah, the final armor piece that you need for the Hidden Ones Raven armor, and that's how you get all five pieces in the game and i hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to collect the other chest using the key that's on this table and i'll see you guys in a future video thank you so much for watching